Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel where I like to share any and all things that bring me joy, hence the name Share Elation. In this video, I wanted to talk a little bit about the various chains that I've purchased um, over the past couple of months to literally dress up my purse. Now this video is not sponsored or partnered with Dress Up Your Purse. I've come across that company or that site through other YouTubers and I thought I'd give it a shot and just see, invest in some chains to uh, make my bags a little bit more diverse and um, you know try to use it in different ways. And so I wanted to just share a little bit about what I got and what I intended to use each of these chains for. Okay, so without further ado, here are the three chains. Now, these two are from Dress Up Your Purse, and this one is actually from Coach. This one is called the Dinky Chain. I'll try to find a link to it below if they still offer it. Um, I purchased this a while back. It was on sale for I think about 20 US dollars and I thought it would be a nice uh, crossbody chain strap, which it obviously is, that I could use on some of my bags. So we'll start with this one first. So I also brought out a couple of my bags just for a little eye candy and um, um, show and tell and to explain my intention of using these chains. So this one I originally bought just to in, um, specifically for this uh, multi and not multi this um, pochette accessoire from Louis Vuitton. This I purchased pre-loved in Japan a couple years back and with the price increases this is just insane how much it has jumped. Uh, I don't remember the exact price that I paid but it was like I think like 300 something US dollars which I feel like is such a good deal compared to how much they're charging and so i was i got this because i wanted to use this as a crossbody bag um as you know it comes with like the leather um vegeta strap which i i removed because i don't really use that strap but i felt the strap is a little short and i wanted to use this as a crossbody so when i got this i would just hook this on like so and I would just have like a little crossbody bag. The color of the gold doesn't quite match the Louis Vuitton gold, but eh, it's close enough. It is, this is a little bit like, I would say like has a, a little bit of pink in it, um, but it's close enough. I mean, there's not a lot of hardware on this anyway, but it was it served my purposes and I was able to use this as like a crossbody bag and with just about a $20 investment. So I did use this a couple times. I like it a lot because there's uh, quite a bit of weight to this. And this bag is very, very light. So it, it kind of helps in that sense that you feel like you know the bag is still on you, if that makes sense. And after I bought this, um, this is one of my newer purchases. This is the uh, Hermes Evelyn TPM size, and I could do the same thing and use this as a crossbody bag as well. Um, just putting this chain on like so, and it dresses up the bag a little bit more because it's a gold chain versus the canvas strap that it comes with. I haven't tried using it this way, but certainly an option, and it makes it a little bit you know, dressier. So I felt that this chain at least served two purposes uh, for this bag and um, uh, the TPM uh, Evelyn and the uh, Pochette Accessoire. So this is that chain. You can see it, it is quite heavy. Now this, these two I did get from Dress Up Your Purse. This is a, I, I will provide links to it down below. Um, the exact length of this. I had to wait for this one to come back in stock. It wasn't available for a while, so I just put my name on the wait list and it, they notified me once they had um, availability again. I wanted this specific length. I want to say, I think this is 60 centimeters. Uh, don't quote me on that. I, I'll, I will provide the link below because I wanted to use this again for these two bags as a shoulder bag. 
Now this particular length, length I kind of measured with like a soft measuring tape on myself before I bought it and I felt like this length worked for me the best. I don't want it to be very short and I also don't want it to be very long. So this is how long it comes out to. When I have it on my shoulder, it's it's a decent length. Like it's not right under your armpit and it's not too low. Uh, for reference, I am about five foot four inches and this comes right under my chest, around my bra line area. Uh, so I hope that helps. And I felt this would be a nice, you know, little shoulder bag if I wanted to use it that way. And I do like these clasps uh, like this, that it opens like that as opposed to um, the tr like a closure like this. Uh, it's just a different style, but I thought this was cute. And I could do the same for this one. And uh, this has obviously the same drop, but I felt like this makes the bag um, a, you know, a little more dressy and another way to use it as opposed to a crossbody bag. I haven't tried using it this way yet, but I definitely will and I can report back afterwards. And so I felt that this was, you know, a, a chain that I could use <clears throat> again on both of these bags. And they're both quite similar in terms of size and capacity. Happy to do a comparison video, but I have seen other YouTubers do this uh, this comparison before. But if you are interested on you know what I carry and how I use it, happy to do that. I don't have any organizers for either one of these because I, I, I mean, I do want to keep its shape, but if I find the need for it, I probably will get one. Uh, I just felt that, you know, because the space is already limited, may not be worth taking up more of the space by putting an organizer in it. But if you have any good suggestions on organizers for these two, let me know. I'm happy to try it out. Um, okay, so put these aside. So that was this middle chain here, and this is longer than the silver one. So you can see the silver one is a little bit shorter. Again, I forget the exact length, but you can see it is a significant amount shorter, maybe like a little under a half um, shorter. I got this length because, I'll put these chains aside, I wanted to use it on my jumbo. This is the single flap jumbo in caviar leather in silver hardware. And I like the, the shoulder strap on it. Like I like that I can use it just as a regular shoulder bag. I know it's not really a cross body because it comes down pretty low on me and most people. Um, and so I wanted something that I can use to make it a little bit like a top handle. Um, just not to use as a top handle, but more like grabbing the bag more easily and being able to use it uh, that way like because I find that when I'm like getting up from my car or just grabbing the bag in general this takes a little bit of uh, fidgeting um, it, it is easier to have a top handle and I've seen other people on YouTube test this out with other chains uh, like from Samorga. I, I, I do like Samorga. I don't have anything from them, but I haven't gotten anything from them only because like the shipping is just, it's like $40 just to get to me. And for dress up your purse, it is free shipping, at least in the US. So I found that uh, the length of this chain here, it is kind of the length that I was looking for. It takes a little bit of maneuvering to get it onto the the, the grommets here, but it does go on. And I would use this as more like a grab and go situation. Like if I was grabbing the bag to leave the house or I was getting up out of my car and I wanna just get it just to hold to leave and then put the strap on my shoulder. That's kind of what I wanted to use it for. I wasn't intending to use this as, as like a regular top handle bag and run around with it like with a chain like this because this is a true shoulder bag. I just thought this would be a handy way to like access the bag without grabbing it like this 
and you know squeezing the leather and distorting it I did get this from Fashion File pre-loved and I want to try and maintain the shape as much as possible um, and not you know damaging or distorting the leather by grabbing it like this so that's kind of how I intended to use this chain now similarly I have here on the side my larger Evelyn bag and this is in the gold color um, it is the Hermes PM size um, I think the measurements are uh, size 29 cm just trying to talk through this while I'm removing this uh, chain from the jumbo and let me try it on the side my intention of using this chain for that bag is similar to the jumbo I wanted to use it as like a, an easy way to grab the bag and go um, because it is a shoulder shoulder style or cross body style strap um, I didn't want to again like grab it by the the leather and I mean I think for the Evelyn bag it's it's different because it doesn't have like the quilting and it's not as prone to like it won't you know flatten the puffs or the quilts but I wanted to use this one similar way by hooking it onto the rings on the two sides like this and this one actually is very has softened up a lot over time um, I did get this pre-love from Japan and I think this is a 2011 bag I, I don't remember um, but I think here it says it's a it's stamped with a J in a square so whatever year that is um, it has softened up over time I have this in the gold color and a navy blue color um, and the navy blue color does have silver hardware as well so I felt like this chain can be used on this one the jumbo and the blue uh, Evelyn that I have and I was going to use it like like this as well like a easy way to grab the bag and go and then I will put this strap on my shoulder or crossbody. And when it's not being used, it just kind of has like a nice little decoration to it where it's dangling on the bag. Sometimes I actually do use this as like a shoulder bag where I just, you know, don't have the time to like take this strap and cross it over my body. Um, and it has worked out pretty well. If this was a little bit longer, that would be ideal for this bag. But I specifically was uh, looking for this chain for the jumbo uh, a little bit more. So maybe it might be worthwhile to get another one of these that's a little bit longer so I can use this as a shoulder style bag. Uh, but I'll play around with it and see how it works out. I just liked that, you know, it's, it's not too expensive. Again, I'll provide the links below. It's free shipping to me in the US. And it was just something I was kind of playing around with and seeing if I can use this to leverage um, the potential of my bags a little bit more. So I hope you found this helpful. If you have any questions on any of the three chains or even the bags that I featured here, please leave a comment down below. I'm happy to answer any questions or if you have any other suggestions on other chains or products that I can use to um, make my bags more versatile. And happy to hear about that as well. So I hope you all have a wonderful day. Stay happy and healthy. Thanks. Bye.